G'day there everyone, Daniel Anderson here. Now today I wanted to share with you a little productivity hack that I learned from a colleague and friend of mine, Matthew Gilbertson, a fellow MVP uh, at ASI Solutions. Now, uh, while presenting recently, and Matt was in the crowd, um, he gave me a little bit of a, t a productivity hack or productivity tip that I cannot get enough of and I needed to share this with everybody because I know this is going to bring value to at least another person out there and that is this concept of having multiple desktops uh, in Windows 11. So it allows you to slide in between different desktops um, for a smoother experience, especially when you're presenting or when you're recording or things like that. It really has made my day uh, Day to day, I guess, operations when I'm recording content or even now when I'm presenting more on stage, really, really easy and more streamlined. Now, you can use this in your day-to-day -day work as well. So you might have different tasks that you're uh, that you're doing throughout the day, and you can just simply uh, switch between different desktops to be able to get to, uh, whether it's an open browser or your email or your task list or something like that. So let's have a look at how we set things up, uh, and then hopefully that's a little bit of a takeaway for you so that you can uh, go and have a try and implement this into your work as well. So we can see here, I'm just in, like I'm just in a browser here, but in the taskbar, we've got this little icon down here. It's a little black and a clear uh, taskbar down here. So what I can do is I can click this taskbar and it opens up uh, my desktops. So you can see that we can add multiple desktops. I've already got three that I've created here. And you can see that I've got desktop one, which has got a browser or the Microsoft Purview Admin Center. I've got desktop two, which is a which is Copilot. And then I've just got a, a, a loop, uh, more my loop works space open in desktop three. So if I jump into desktop one, you can see that that brings up this browser. Now there's a little uh, keyboard shortcut here as well, where I can go control windows, the windows key and the right arrow, and I can simply switch between each desktop and it's nice and smooth and slick and it's just a way easier uh, approach to switching between different applications rather than minimizing, maximizing, dragging things across different windows and that type of thing as well. So it's a really great way for you to be able to switch between different experiences. So I just wanted to share that with you um, as a little bit of a productivity hack. Uh, and thank you, Matt, for sharing that with me. Uh, and I hope that brings you some value today.